Welcome to UIW fans all across the world. We have people watching in Wales, we have people watching in California, maybe even some in Japan. The show could be very interesting today, ladies and gentlemen. And, oh. Yes, I think that's William Gacy. Yes, it is. It is William Gacy, ladies and gentlemen. The UIW Legacy Champion. Cut my music. I think he's got something to say. Well, first of all, I'm wearing these sunglasses because to hide my eyes. They're all red from crying. Really upset. I can keep my composure here. I guess I should be happy, but I'm not. The war is over, folks. It'll be in all the history books, probably one sentence since it lasted a couple of weeks. They put up such a valiant effort, didn't they? But XCW, I'm sorry, is dead. That's right, XCW, extremely chubby wrestlers are no longer. Let's please all bow our heads and have a moment of silence for the demise <coughs> of XCW. Okay, that's good enough. Now, I got a couple things I want to talk about here. First of all, it's about Dr. Bringle. Now, Dr. Bringle is not here today. Uh, got a text message that he is out uh, picketing Burger King with the XCW wrestlers because they raised the Whopper 25 cents. It's kind of upsetting for them. Only be able to pay for three or four now for a snack. <laughs> so he is he is not here. I'd like to hear him to be here so I could give t say to him face to face, man to man. But he will no longer be the GM of UIW. I'm going to take that job back. Dr. Bringle has been too physical with many of the wrestlers, and therefore I did warn him before. I gave him a last warning, and he decided to keep on going his way. So he will no longer be the GM. He will go back as a wrestler, and that's fine. The next thing I have to say is my legacy title. I sit here and won this from a five-time champion. Also, I def defended it against the person who had the world title the longest, the reigning title, and I defeated him. So I really don't think I have nothing else to prove, so I'm going to relinquish this title and the new champion will be decided on our next pay-per-view with the tournament. I will decide the kind of matches. I will decide who is worthy of being in that tournament. And I will announce that in the next pay-per-view. With all that being cited right now, I'm going to call down to the ring someone I have a little beef with. So if Tiger, if Mel the Tiger Maul will please come down to the ring, I got a little, uh, little something to tell you. Yeah, he's not worthy of any music. Let's cut that. Now, I thought you you think you're pretty funny, don't you? You know, I, I go and and we had a deal. We had a deal, didn't we? Did we not have a deal? Uh, yes, we had a deal. Come a little closer to get the microphone. But yeah, we had a deal, and and I believe one of us didn't live up to that to the end of our bargain. Just kind of taking a, a a multiple choice here. Would it be you or me? A me or B you? A or B? Uh, B. B. You. Well, yeah, you're right. You know, and and I see you're in your wrestling gear, so so you're pretty much well. You want to try this from a referee to a wrestler, sort of a Danny Davis type thing, don't you? Yeah. Oh, do you? Okay. Well, let's see here. Who can we take you up against? You want to guess, get that top level, don't I guess you? Guess my mom's gonna have a match. Yeah. So 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 you just want to climb all the way to the top with one match. What one match? One match. One match now. Okay, let's see if you can get to the top. How about we pitch you up against a five-time champion? How's that sound? No, 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 because your match right now is going to be against... Well, let's just see who comes down here, won't we? Whoa, whoa, whoa. 
Yeah. You think you're ready for it? But okay, we got Zoe down here. And I, I could let her be referee. That would be Just an above good. par parsley. So and what should I do? His manager slash fuck you know buddy, Miss McVeigh. I think I'll referee this match. I guess it's gonna be Justin Buff Par Parsley versus Mel the Tiger Maw. With William Gacy as the special guest referee. Oh, here's the bell. Once I hear that bell, you're done. Ring the bell. Hey, pull the hair. Come on. He Watch did. for the he hair. The hair. Watch for the hair, all right? Mel the Tiger Mall throw him above par parsley down. <coughs> Saying he pulled the hair. Punches. Oh, slammed his head into the fence. That was sick. Leg drop. Ah, oh, Mel Mala versing the suplex, suplexing just above par parsley. Ah, ah. Will I give it? No. Will I give it? No. Ah. Half-assed German suplex. Ah. Come on, Justin. Ah. No, Get out. Ah. No. Get out. Miss no. McVeigh cheering for her. Unless she manages. Mel Ma Mel Ma with that weird hammerlock submission. Slapping. Get out. Just in both part partially reversing it. Tigers, you want to call it? No. Mel Ma saying no. Just an above par parsley holding Mel Mall and a really epic headlock and then give him that really epic bulldog. You want to give it up? Uh, no. Slap me in the head, Junior! Uh, you son of a bitch! Uh, get up now! Who are you? Uh, Who are you? I'm the champion! Uh, Just an above par, par parsley claiming himself as a champion. I do not believe that he is the champion. Mom all reversing whatever move that was. Oh. Headbutt to the spine. You give it up. No. Another headbutt. <laughs> What's Mel Mall going for? <laughs> whatever it was, above par parsley reversing it. Just the above par parsley stealing a, a move out of Chris Jones's book. Just the above par parsley taking that belt off and beating Mel Ma like he's a rat, like like he's some kind of animal. You want to be a wrestler? Mel Ma taking just the above par parsley down. My way. William Gacy getting to that count kind of slow there. Yeah. We, we have one trillion nine hundred and twenty-two billion six hundred forty-three million six hundred thirty-three thousand people watching at home, ladies and gentlemen. Some all across the globe. We got some in Canada, some in Greenland, Wales. Ah, oh, pedigree taking Mel Tiger Mall down. We got some in Fiji, China, Asia. Could this be three? Two. Oh. Two count, Mel Mall kicking out. UIW reaching across the globe. Oh. What could Mel Mall be going for? Oh. Like some type of sledgehammer off the fence. Mom, we got him in a pin. Two count. 
Bum all the rookie needs to realize you can't keep Justin above par parsley down with that half ass pin. Oh. Big kick. Uh. Chops to Melma. Uh. Oh, spear to Mel Mall. Mel Mall's head bouncing off that fence. That could possibly work in Parsley's favor. Miss oh, McVeigh still at ringside. Thinking Mel Mall might cry. Oh, you're gonna win. <laughs> Big Bulldog. Man, I got something on my hand. What was that? Hey! Well, I got something. I got something on my hand. Look, man. Well, Gacy's got I, something I, I, in I his finger now. I mean, come on. No. No. Oh, code breaker. R E M. One, two, three. That's it. Just an above par parsley beating Mo Mo. Once again, William Gacy <laughs> screwing somebody. Oh. <laughs> Big kick oh. right in front of the camera. Woo! The winner of the match, Justin Above Par Parsley. I think Mo Moment might need a few hints on how to win a match, ladies and gentlemen. Especially with Gacy as the referee. We gotta get ready for the next match.